for this project I call LiDAR Super Canon we're gonna need uh, one uh, stove or gas or, or gas barbecue LiDAR one regular LiDAR one cheap pen one uh, empty clean one quarter of gallon paint container or can with a lid a piece of strap so we can strap it this can and few pieces of wood I'm gonna give you some dimension like 11 by 9 this one is five and a quarter two pieces four and a half and two pieces like uh, two and a quarter so first what you need to do and also we're gonna need a few tools like uh, several several different size drill bits some screwdriver pliers and some screws so first what we're gonna do we're gonna need to drill the holes in this wood I already pre drilled the holes so what you need to do drill the holes of course on all this wood on all pieces of the wood drill the holes when that done then we can build the actually stand for a lighter super cannon so first goes to those two pieces like this let me just get the screws all right so first you're gonna put the in the middle a little bit off the edge that much probably put some put screws uh, you can glue it if you want I use the screws is faster like this another one here make sure that the size of this it's actually fit in between those two edges see so this is perfect size you see and another one here so before we screw second one we're gonna put it in to see if it fits properly yep this is good put the screws and put this screw so when this part is done we can check it perfect then we're gonna get the strap we're gonna get the different screws smaller screws and we're gonna put the strap like this one side this are probably better in the middle you're gonna put this screw here in the middle like this we're gonna put the can and then we're gonna then another screw need a screw down not inside down so you're gonna force it a little bit can it might smash a little bit but it's fine here we go okay so you see now this can it can spin but it doesn't move so the next piece is this one it's supposed to go back to hold so just the can doesn't go back once when you put the lid you need to tap it with your hand to close the lid so this actually piece the wood you're gonna hold this you're gonna hold this uh, you wanna hold the can to doesn't go back also you need to put this one a little bit out like this yeah it's perfect like this so leave the gap a little bit here because this piece is actually gonna go here now so first you're gonna screw this one Here we go. Once when you do this, there, these are a little bit different. One is smaller, one is bigger. One is actually two inch. One is one is a two and a quarter. So you're gonna use the one that it's uh, smaller, two inch, and you're gonna screw it this way against this one. And this one gonna go later, actually in the middle. That's the one that's gonna hold uh, our lighter. So when all this done, then what we need to do, we need to have this uh, stove or barbecue lighter, 
get a small screwdriver maybe the one that you have it doesn't have a screw but it's just glue or something but this needs to be open so we can take it out one piece which is very important for this project get uh, this pliers and take this piece out here we go so now open slowly and what you need to do disconnect this tiny hole don't break it pull it out disconnect Oop. I think I broke it no I didn't that's fine put this piece back so all this need to go back like it is because this is uh, we're gonna need this piece okay I forgot mention uh, earlier once when you take it out when you open up this uh, bar barbecue lighter what we need to do we need to take it out this white piece so the gas doesn't go out we don't need this gas coming out so just flip it so we take it out this piece so we're not gonna need uh, this this, gonna, this has to stay inside in order to hold uh, that ignition igniter whatever they call okay put this thing back okay it works spark yep we have a spark that's good so this is gonna go back and this goes back too so one when this is done we have this piece on one side you're gonna take it out this rubber ring a larger one let's see well you actually don't need to that's fine you can leave it take this pen take this out take the pen out and take this piece out so here you see here it's a smaller you're gonna cut it out piece about one inch with a hand saw I have a my saw so I'm going to cut on my saw, big one. Here you go, you see, it needs to be cut like one inch. So this we need to do because this small tiny hole is going to go here and just leave it maybe like tiny bit before you get to the end. And when you do this, then you need to glue it with a glue gun. We need to glue it very carefully so it doesn't burn this tiny hole see see how it's bent because it's it's kind of melting this hole but we need to glue it a very good so that it doesn't leak see it's kind of actually so this we're gonna leave it somewhere on the side to let cool off and we're gonna continue to do different other things once when this is done what we need to do we need to have a drill smallest bit maybe like one eight inch maybe a little bigger than one eight inch and drill one hole here on the side like this actually what we need to do we need to drill the whole exact size of this pen so we're gonna go now with a little bit let's see okay I'm gonna apply more glue here need to be sealed very well here we go and let it cool off again all right perfect see so that perfect hole so here on the back in the middle we need to drill the hole too the whole size of this slider so again we're going to start with a smaller bit Maybe jerk a little bit yep. perfect okay so when this all done clean all this shaving 
Okay, so let's go put the finger here and okay, it's it's sealed perfectly. So what we need to do, this one need to go in here. We're gonna put this thing like this somehow. Get the glue up. Get the glue gun and glue it. So this needs to be sealed very well so the gas doesn't escape. You might need to hold it a little bit. Okay, so once when this is glued very well, sealed very well, now it's time to put this piece, so we need to put in the middle, actually here, you see, this is going to be support for our lighter. So again, we're going to put in the middle one screw. So very important to see this one has those holes where air goes through. So actually we need to put them inside here, a little behind these holes, like maybe quarter inch behind. So about here and then get the hot glue gun and glue it first underneath like this and put around and now we need to wait again until the glue it's actually dries leave it like this in the meantime what you need to do get the lighter this is the best lighter because the more important is we need to take out this piece out and more important is this lighter has a longer dead nozzle you see the like kind of gold one because this tiny pipe gonna go in that nozzle like this. So actually we don't need this piece, you can take it out. This piece can go out. We just need this and of course we can take gas out. What you're gonna do, we're gonna put in here and we're gonna need one rubber band. This one, like this, larger band. So what do you need, wrap it twice and this is what you're going to hold your lighter. Of course, when lighter it goes out and it's empty, you're going to replace another one. When you've done this, this tiny hose is supposed to hook it up on that here nozzle. Here we go. See? Once when that is done, now we need to put, we need to seal it here around. Very good. Seal it with a with the glue gun. Because if it's any hole remaining, the gas is gonna go out, there will be no explosion, cannon will, will not work. So I apply the second coat of glue, it's sealed very well. You can see inside how it looks like. I don't know if you can see it, but here on this side you have that gas nozzle coming. In the middle it's our igniter. So let's try how far it's up. Lead, put it your hand, tap it a little bit. Very important, you need to hold this uh, lighter for 30 to 35 seconds. No more than that because it might not light up. If you put too much gas inside, it won't light up. If you hold for 20 seconds, it will be too low gas, it will be just a flame. So I figure out 30, 35 is perfect also. Keep the lighter on high, high position. So let's do it. One, two, fire. All right. Thirty second fire. <laughs> 